quantity, the amounts of... We need to appreciate the liberties and the freedom we have in the United States. Needed. A little silver on the tank. Yep. Real. <laughs>so back in the states in the car gonna visit john see him for the first time haven't seen him in two months spoke with him every once in a while over uh whatsapp did video uh video talks and stuff like that i was actually getting updates of what he's doing through his thanks to his uh cycle fanatics uh updates he saw my uh jerusalem uh tour and my harley davidson israel tour as well he said he enjoyed it very much. Anyway, going to visit him, say hello. Uh, a lot of things I have to get done over here. I have here about a month. I didn't say that. I didn't update you before, but, you know, this corona thing is is crazy. Well, uh, God bless America. Let me explain. Thanks. Uh, we should be grateful to this uh, country this land of the free that we have over here big difference israel is democracy as well so is uh so is uh the united states when i went to israel they just put out a uh, a quarantine mandate anyone coming in has to stay quarantined at home for two weeks no questions asked can't avoid it i was for two weeks i was home in my house believe it or not twice people came to check on me uh, not police, but, uh, you know, the health authorities. Huge difference when I get back to the States at the airport. Uh, I hear over the PA an announcement. Uh, you are expected, listen, you're not, you're not required. You are expected to complete a voluntary quarantine. What a difference. What a difference. This is the land of the free. And again, I'm not getting into politics where we, we should have uh, a mandated quarantine if we have to or not. I'm just telling you, we need to we need to appreciate the liberties and the freedom we have in the United States. We, we just have to. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that uh, not having quarantine mandated or quarantine mandated is better. One way is better than the other. All I'm saying is that we should appreciate and be thankful for the liberties and freedom we have in this country. I'm excited. I'm putting the uniform on after nine months uh, flying to Dubai today. I love it. So I came back again, you know, uh, my daughter didn't, wasn't crazy about the shirt I got her, the design. So we're going in to, to change the shirt, to switch the shirt. I park uh, down by the, you know, the parking area, minus three, and we see this crazy, crazy display of all the continuation of their inventory. I guess like they, they rented this whole area to throw in, uh, to, to put all this, uh, it's all, I guess, used used bikes. Look at the, uh, the quantity, the amount of bikes just waiting for me to take one of them. I don't get it. What's what's the deal? I'm gonna ask them what, what they do with all these. But look at them, all dusty, sitting outside in the element, open to the elements. What's that? Yeah, USA. <laughs> look at it, all dusty. Oh my man, look at that, unbelievable. Nice bikes, but all you can't even see from all the dust. Yes, yeah, like got it, all the. What are they doing with all these? Oh, I got the paint job on this. Oh my God! Look at the amount of bikes back here. I'd say there's about like 300 bikes. What do you say, 300 bikes? Easy, right? Wow. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow. 
what a shame. All this metal installed and the smell of the gas sitting in a parking lot. Oh my God, wow. Easy, 300, 400 bikes. taking pictures of a cow that you saw. <laughs> 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 area people come here with their ATVs motorcycles the dirt bikes end of November weather is great somebody wasn't happy with the fact that it's a an archaeological site then you're not allowed to step in here so it's on the floor funny how relative things are these rocks this structure 2,000 years old we complain that our houses are 50 years old This is cactus, what do you call, uh, forgot what it's called, what fruit, what fruit is it called? It's very, very sweet inside, but the outside is full of microscopic little uh, thorns and it's impossible to eat it. You need to boil it and get all the little thorns off. Empty, Friday night. So, that being said, I'm here for the last four days. Uh, jet lag is pretty much behind me. Gonna visit John. Uh, just winterized, just, just finished de-winterizing my bike. I put out a video uh, the other day of how I did it. For the next month, I'm uh, home again. And then I have to go uh, back to Israel. Believe it or not, I actually got the approval of the marketing manager in Harley Davidson, Israel, he's allowing me to have a test ride to take uh, to take a bike out, take a Harley out uh, for a full day. So I'm going to take you once I'm back in Israel. I'm going to take you to a a place where you have never, probably never seen, and it's going to be amazing, amazing. So stay tuned to that. That's going to be next month. While I'm here. Weather permitting, of course. I'm uh, gonna go on rides. I have a few upgrades to do. And just hang out with John, family, friends, and Harley community, you know? There's uh, there's uh, next Sunday, I think. It's the first Sunday of the month of January. A bike, uh, what's it called? Bikes and Breakfast uh, over at Palisades. If you wanna come see, uh, meet us uh, there. John is gonna be, I'm gonna be there few other guys I'm gonna say hello to John now stay tuned am I at the wrong address check back at the gym maybe he's at the gym maybe he's working out he's not here few moments later and then he lets me wait He's like, oh, I'm home, I'm home. And then he's like, oh, no, I'll be home in two minutes. Just pulled in. Oh, wow, what a truck. I know what he's doing. You know what he's doing right now? He's videotaping, he's recording. That's what he's doing. <laughs> what did I tell you, huh? <laughs> oh, he's 
fly, you vlogged in two, huh? No, always with the camera oh, in my hand. Oh, it's a little guy. What's up? What's going on? Oh, oh there you go. Where, where you been? How you doing, my man? How are you? Good. Where good, you been? Good. I've been uh, away. Israel. Israel. Yeah, Israel. Yeah. Two months. Check out his videos. Wow. wow. He's been in Israel. Unbelievable. The weather over there is amazing. Tell All right, you. Let me let me say hi to this guy. I'll cut yeah. the uh, recording now, and I'll come back a little. Oh, look at the inside. Look at the inside of this shack, this shed. And this is the first time I'm actually seeing John's uh, front fairing wrap. So it looks really, really nice. Really, really nice. Yeah, it does. Wow. It does, right? It, looks it does. Good. Yeah. It just totally changes the bike. That's Absolutely. what it needed. A little silver on the tank. Yep. Really nice. A little bit on the fender in the back. But I think that's... right there yep actually what you can do is take this off mm, and nah. put it instead I, I, i'll give it nah, I'll get you a i like it actually let me get you nah. a screwdriver i don't think so dude <laughs> <laughs> all right it's not sticking no i think you want Too a heat cold. gun do you have a heat gun cold it's uh below freezing right now and the outer piece is not it's it's not Why separating it like it's that? what? Why does it sound like that? <laughs> it's not separating from so we're gonna heat it up with a little heat gun. Not too hot, you don't want the tank to explode. <laughs> or my fingers to melt. <laughs> there you go. Oh you're smart. Of course I'm smart. Psych! You see, this whole time he was waiting for me to come and do all these uh, jobs, these installs. He just couldn't do it without me. I didn't know how to. Exactly. Freaking cold, man. It is. <laughs> I'm not used to this. I come, you know, in Israel, it's every day is like 60, 70 degrees. Wow. At this time. And sunny. I'm here, everything is below zero. <laughs> 